Storm Tracker 7 weather is presented by Panhandle Cleaning and Restoration. Hey, how's it going, Ohio Valley? Meteorologist Tyler Vanji here. Let's figure out what's going on with this weather because it's actually a nice start to our work week for our Monday, but quick look at your satellite and radar it may say otherwise just to our west through central Columbus and central Ohio. Noticing some light drizzle, not really picking up a whole lot, but that is intended to develop. And as we move forward, we are outlined in a one out of five, that being a marginal risk for severe weather. Although I'm only expecting maybe the portions of Guernsey, Noble, down through uh, Belmont, Monroe, and the southern portion of the Panhandle, Tyler and Wetzel County to even see any of this action. Maybe just some light rain as we move forward, but into your morning tomorrow, could see that thunderstorm action picking up again as you head out for work or school. Now, the reason why it's been so warm across the Ohio Valley is due to this ridge that's high pressure, that warmth continuing to funnel in from the central, basically Texas and the Gulf of Mexico, continuing to usher up that warmth. And that's exactly what we're seeing here. Temperatures not really fluctuating a whole lot because you don't have that temperature contrast between the warm and the cold. We're kind of sitting right on that boundary, if you will, that stationary boundary and battling it out with the warm and the cold and deciding who's going to see that sunshine and who's going to get stuck under this cloud coverage and precipitation. Well, moving forward through the next 24 hours, here's what to expect. Temperatures like we just talked about not varying a whole lot and your dew point is keeping right up with that temperature. So we're staying saturated, a little bit humid actually moving forward, but those winds will continue to increase due to that isobaric pattern. What is that? Well, well I just showed you those ridges in the upper levels, and that's what's continuing to pick up those wind speeds as we head through your day tomorrow. But nonetheless, we enjoy warmth for our day today. We maxed out right around 74 degrees, and we continue to enjoy warmth as we move forward. No record setting heat or though, and that's something to be glad about as it is rather warm out there. And tomorrow morning we'll start right around the lower 50s. That's actually where we started for our day today. We're continuing that warmth in the morning, so no preheating the car and just enjoying maybe t-shirt and short weather. And that's my favorite temperatures. We'll max out right around 69 degrees, partly cloudy skies. It's gonna start out ugly with that rain and cloud coverage, but then by the time we get to lunch, here comes the sunshine and we're gonna enjoy that over the next three days. So. Just get out there and enjoy it. Maybe plan something over the next three days because it's not very likely to see conditions as nice as they will be. Here's a look at how we finish out our nights now. Checking out Zanesville. So we're talking Guernsey Noble. Moving through the southern portion of the Panhandle through our night tonight. That's that building towards central Ohio. That's what we're looking at right here as it pushes through the central Ohio. That's for tonight and it will be short lived and wrap up. I'm talking scattered showers. We're not really seeing a whole lot of development in if you check the time, it's almost sunset. We're getting closer to it. We're not going to see a whole lot of that sun heating us up, and that's what we need to see that development of thunderstorm action. So tonight we're just going to deal with some scattered showers, but as we wake up for your Tuesday, it's looking like the same thing. But by the time we head into lunch, here comes the clear skies, and we're going to continue that trend for the next three days. So not only for your Tuesday, Wednesday, your Thursday, but then as we get closer to Friday, here comes some more cloud coverage, just beautiful weathers. And here's a look at all that on your seven day forecast. A little bit windy for our Tuesday, not to mention as we head out of our Tuesday. But then Wednesday and Thursday, nothing to complain about. Maybe mow the grass and we enjoy that sunshine even to your Friday. But then as we head into your weekend, here comes the rain.